Hey everyone, Josh here. Today I want to talk about the Force Link. And I want to give this thing a second try. Um, I've already done some reviews on this thing previously. I've done a, I did a couple reviews on my channel already. And if you saw those reviews, you know this thing at the least frustrated me. Um, I feel it didn't work as advertised. Um, and if you're not familiar with what the Force Link is, it is a little scanner that you scan the action figures with that has to be a Force Link action figure from the Last Jedi line and or the Force Link toy line. And those figures have little tiny chips embedded in them and this is basically a chip reader. And so when you scan the figures there's a little speaker on the back here and what it'll do will recite lines from the movie. And in my previous reviews this thing was very frustrating for me. I didn't have a good time with it and I didn't have a lot of good things to say about it. And I recently did a Force Link figure review. It was the Imperial Probe Droid with Darth Vader. And in that video I asked anybody who was watching if you could give me any tips on how to make this thing work a little better. And I had a couple people leave comments on my channel and give me some tips on how to make this thing work a little better. And apparently I was doing some things wrong, so what I want to do now is take this thing over to my toy studio, we'll get out some Force Link figures, and we'll scan the figures, and we'll see if we can get some better results out of this thing. What the goal is, is you want to get multiple sayings out of each figure, and the problem I was having was you would scan a figure and try to get the next uh, saying out of them, and it would just repeat the same phrase over and over and over, and what we want to do is we want to get different phrases each time. So I want to thank anybody who left a comment, give me some tips on this thing. It was very helpful. Um, I've had a lot better results with it off camera. And now let's take it and film it and put it on camera and see if we get any uh, get better results. So let's do this. Let's go. Come on. All right, guys, here we are in the toy studio with a several Force Link figures. And the force link is here as well. Here it is. And it's already turned on. And we are going to try and get multiple phrases out of these figures. And I have worked with this thing off camera. And I've had off and on results. We'll see if we can make this thing work a little bit better. I want to, I want to, I want this thing to work. <laughs> so, but just so you guys kind of understand what's going on here, I have the instruction manual. And if you look here, it tells you how to work the force link. So as you can see, you're supposed to strap it onto your hand. And my hand is a little too big for that. So we're going to have to just hold on to it today for today's purposes. But it tells you tap force link to turn on. Pick up figure to activate phrases. See hand placement. And then... It, you may have seen other people, and in my previous videos, you saw me jerking this thing around, and you might have wondered what I was doing. Well, right here it tells you move figure forward or side to side to activate additional effects. And then finally, it tells you here continue tapping Force Link for more sounds. So you're supposed to tap the back of it. And so, what I'm assuming here is that this thing works off of the vibration from you tapping it. And I'm finding out that tapping it really doesn't work all that well. So what we're going to do here is we're going to pull a figure out. And this is Darth Vader. And he comes in a two-pack with the Imperial Probe Droid over here. And what I'm finding is if you actually tap it on the table, it seems to work a little bit better. So here we go. I've heard some sound effects there. There we go. And I've heard more phrases than that out of this figure. So let's see if we can get more. Until they are found. 
Okay, so we're getting more more sayings out of them than just one. That was the problem I was having in the past. I kept getting the same phrase over and over and over and over again, and each figure has several different phrases. Prepare your troops for a surface attack. All right, very good. So that is working a little better. And what I'm finding I'm having to do here, and, and I know if you're wearing this, you can't do it, but I'm finding if I just tap it on the tabletop, it it seems to feel the vibration that is, you're supposed to get from tapping it. So let's see what else we get here. Here's... Boba Fett with his super flamethrower, and he came in a two-pack with Han Solo, and of course this is not a screen-used uh, flamethrower, it's an action figure flamethrower, it's a toy accessory, but there you go, Boba Fett with a turbo flamethrower, but let's see what we can get him to say here. We got some sound effects there. I think that was supposed to be the flamethrower. Now I'm, I know he says stuff because I've gotten. To, no good to me, dead. There we go. Anakin Skywalker. <laughs> I think mine might be glitching here. He's no good to me, dead. All right, so there you go. We got a couple different phrases out of Boba Fett. Um, and again, if you guys have any tips for me on how to make this thing work better, I'm pretty frustrated with this thing. And, and maybe this is the extent of its abilities here. Let me know what you think in the comments. But let's try Ray here. We got a Ray figure. I'm with the resistance. You're going to pay for what you did. Okay, very cool. The first orders are everywhere. Everywhere. You're going to pay for what you did. Okay, so we've got three phrases out of her so far. The first orders are everywhere. Okay. You're going to pay for what you did. The first orders are everywhere. I'm with the resistance. Okay, so there you go. We have about three sayings we got out of Ray. That's more than I got previously. Previously, I could only get one. So let's see what we can get Luke Skywalker from The Last Jedi to say. May the Force be with you. Come, I'll show you the true meaning of the Force. Trust your instincts. Okay, it sounds like a force push or something. Come, I'll show you the true meaning of the force. Trust your instincts. Come, I'll show you the true meaning of the force. All right, May so the force be with you. We got about well, we got about three out of Luke. That's not bad. It's better than I had before. So we are making progress here. I feel the power of the force. I know what I have to do. What do you have to do? Okay, so we got three different sayings out of Kylo Ren. That's pretty good. And to be honest, here's a Praetorian Guard. I'm not even sure if these guys talk in the movie. So let's see if we get any sayings out of them. Okay. Alright, so you just get combat sounds out of this figure so I don't think these guys actually speak in the movie so 
There we go. And finally here we have the Imperial Probe Droid. Let's see what we get out of this guy here. Okay, so he doesn't really say much either in the movie. That was pretty much all the sound effects. And while you hear, see me tapping it, like I said, I'm just trying to emulate or simulate the tapping. I'm assuming the way this thing works is it, it responds off the vibration of you tapping it. And so I'm finding that if I just bang it on the table... May the force be with you. It, it gives it the vibration it needs to move to the next phrase. Come, I'll show you the true meaning of the Force. Trust your instincts. Come, I'll show you the true meaning of the Force. So, but, again, guys, if, if you guys have any tips for me or any suggestions or can help me out with this thing, or maybe, like I said, this is just what it... it each figure has three phrases. They don't tell you on the box how many... On the packaging, they don't tell you how many lines or phrases each figure has, so I don't know. And one of the ones that's really curious to me, I don't know if you guys heard it, I swear I heard Anakin Skywalker from uh, Revenge of the Sith on Boba Fett. So... And see, there's got to be more to Boba Fett than that. Come on, guy. All right. Let's go. All right. Whoa. Okay, so there it is, guys. That's how I can get it to work. If you have one, maybe you're having better results than I am, but there it is, everyone. There is your Force Link, and my best attempt at getting the figures to scan, and maybe we'll give it another try later on, but to be completely honest with you, I'm not all that impressed with this thing. Um, if you're at all familiar with the Phantom Menace toy line, you'll remember they had something very similar to this that came out. It was called the ComTech Chip Reader. And it was much simpler, much easier to use. It actually had buttons on it, and you could push the buttons and get the, the sayings out of them. And then also on the packaging, if you looked on the back, it told you the four or five lines that each figure said, so you knew what to expect. Now here, you uh, it's it's random. So, But there you go, guys. There is the Force Link from the Last Jedi toy line, or the Force Link toy line. And thanks for watching, everyone. I appreciate it. Bye.